Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. Super Shuffle. Hi, this is Gene Simmons, and this is my shuffle. When I first heard Friday on My Mind by the Easy Beats, I didn't know that there was going to be a connection to ACDC. The uh, two guys in the band, Van and Young, then went on to form a band called Flash in the Pan. Very good, Gene. But uh, Easy Beats had this crazy song that quarterly eludes me certainly not blues based these licks and then right before the chorus the chords move the way notes move if you try to play those notes they're hectic try playing it as chords here's friday on my mind by the easy beats celebrity shuffle gene simmons Super Shuffle. Unit 4 Plus 2 was an English band that had very strange influences. Bossa Nova, sort of cha-cha South American beats with jazz overtones and very Beatlesque melodies against a chordal structure that defies logic. Here's Unit 4 Plus 2 in a song called Concrete and Clay. Celebrity Shuffle. Gene Simmons. Serious Super Shuffle. Jackie Wilson, one of the preeminent templates for lead singers. Uh, there would be no Joe Tex, there would be no anybody without Jackie Wilson. Jackie Wilson was such an important figure in music that there were actually songs written about Jackie. He was a guy that, that was very acrobatic, can do splits, jump up, way before guys like James Brown came across and started doing that stuff. Raised in the church, uh, this was pure pop big band. It's a big band playing with a real rock pop background. Here's Workout, Baby Workout by Jackie. Hey, you! Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. Super Shuffle. Hi, this is Gene Simmons, and this is my shuffle. The early 60s were a peculiar time, because at the same time that radio was trying to figure out how to play rock and roll, which was still in its infancy, every once in a while you'd hear very bizarre instrumentals by groups that it would only come for one song, like the Tornadoes. So at the same time that these instrumental bands were doing music to watch girls by by the Bob Crew generation, instrumentals were big. Even Kiss did an instrument called Love Theme from Kiss. But one of the unique songs of all time was this kind of Latin-flavored, sleepy Hawaiian guitar by two guys who up until then had had no success whatsoever, but immediately it grabs you. Here's Sleepwalk by Santo and Johnny. <laughs> Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. Super Shuffle. You're going to hear Running with the Devil by Van Halen, a band I saw in its infancy at a place called the Starwood. It was a club in Los Angeles. They were the warm-up band to the headliner, and it was just a club band. I went backstage and immediately convinced the band, Eddie, Alex, Roth, obviously, that they should not sign with a yogurt manufacturing company guy who was going to support them, but that I would fly them to New York and produce their demo at Electric Lady Studios, and I did. I worked with the band, tried to figure out what arrangement worked, what didn't, and we picked 15 songs, and they were recorded on a 24-track, and this was their demo, is Running With The Devil, Van Halen. Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. Serious Super Shuffle. Hi, this is Gene Simmons, and this is my shuffle. Shannon Tweed's favorite song is the, uh, okay, I lied. Shannon Tweed's, <laughs> one of her favorite songs, Love Theme by the Love Unlimited Orchestra. Barry White doesn't even put his name up there. Barry White, at the height of his uh, popularity, was not only going out there and doing sellout shows to women who would clearly be swooning at a man who was approaching 300 pounds and yet had the voice of a fo phone uh, porn star. Yeah, baby, you know you want to say He hardly sang the songs, but before rap, before anything, this guy cornered the, oh yeah, come to daddy type of, of music. Uh, he produced his own records, often wrote his own tunes, and actually got up like Jackie Gleason, but that's another story, and was a maestro, and I believe he wrote the theme for Love Theme by the Love Unlimited Orchestra and conducting Barry White. Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. 
Super. Magic by Pilot is a gem by the middle period of English music. The group had a big album that I was aware of and after that disappeared. But this song, Magic, combines all the best things of English pop music, great songwriting, terrific production by Alan Parsons, who himself would go on to form his own band called the Alan Parsons Project. And the engineer was a guy named Mike Stone, who would later work with Kiss and with Paul on some of his projects, including an uh, band called New England. But in the meantime, here is a magical song, Magic by Pilot. <laughs> Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. Super Shuffle. Hi, this is Gene Simmons, and this is my Shuffle. I put together a Kiss Tribute album because I didn't want to wait for anybody else to do it. You'd only get the respect you demand, and so why not throw a party for yourself? So I called up everybody I could think of, and somebody offered up Toe the West, Wet Sprocket, and Toe the Wet Sprocket decided to record Rock and Roll All Night, which was a curious case, and they had complete latitude to do what they wanted with the song, and what came out was a fascinating sound, which changed the drum beat, even had a different chordal passage going into the chorus, but if anything, it reminds me of Jackson Brown. Here's Toe the Wet Sprocket doing Rock and Roll All Night. Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons, Serious Super Shuffle. Going Blind was a song I wrote with my school chum, Stephen Carnell, and in those days I didn't think much about lyrics and have no clue why I sat down and wrote a lyric called I Think I'm Going Blind, except that I thought it was terribly romantic. It was about an old guy. I remember a movie called the, uh, Hemingway's The Old Man and the Sea, and my vision of that was the old man and a mermaid. Uh, little lady from the land beyond the sea, you know, and all that kind of stuff. She was this kind of love interest for this old guy. And when we were recording the song, Paul Stanley thought that the lyrics were ridiculous, of course, and he yelled out, I'm 93, you're 16. And for no reason that I can think of, I stuck in those, that was it, Paul Stanley's sole contribution to that song, I'm 93, you're 16, can't you see I'm going blind? Of course, it makes absolutely no sense. I can't tell you what going blind means, except everybody's told me what it means. Every single version has been a different story. Here's Going Blind by Kiss. Celebrity Shuffle, Gene Simmons. Super Shuffle. Thanks for listening. This is Gene Simmons. If you don't know who I am, ask your sister and your mommy. They'll tell you all about me. Uh, meantime, of course, you're glued to the television set on A&E, watching our Gene Simmons Family Jewels program on every Sunday night. Of course, you're picking up more KISS swag because we have close to 3,000 licensed merchandised items. If you want some coffee, go to Myrtle Beach for our first KISS Coffee House franchise. If you want to clean uh, any part of your body, any crevice, may, may as well make it smell good. Go to any one of 2,000 department stores and pick up the KISS fragrance line, including shampoos, wax, body lotions, anything you want for him and for her. Ad infinitum ad nauseum. We have KISS condoms and KISS caskets, and that's my cue to skidoo. And I'm very sincere.